Good afternoon, everyone. Alter report for May. Wet bots, cliff high, half past human, talking about atmospheric compression events, rivers from the sky. I have two instances here that I think you're really going to like. After I saw them, I was shocked. It looks like an electric scorpion tail. And these atmospheric compression events actually turned our atmosphere black on the radar. I'll show you what I got. You're going to really like it. And as you're watching the video, please remember to subscribe to ADAPT 2030. On to the seven seas, May 2017, halfpasthuman.com, Cliff High, the web bots. Alta report calling absolutely decimating floods so heavy they call it a rain train. Cargo cars of rain, otherwise known as atmospheric compression events. I'm still always amazed by the power of nature, but what you're about to see right here is you're going to sit back in your chair and go, wow, what was that? So the storm is in the beginning of May had this storm front that came through that quickly evolved into something. It really was a river of rain that came down. So when we're looking at the radar pattern, you rarely see black. That is so high of intensity and such density. That's literally a river pouring out of the sky. But it just didn't happen once, happened several times, and then it turned into a cyclonic spinning low. Why don't I let you just watch it real time here? And this was quickly followed by another set of storms on May 8th with the exact same atmospheric compression pattern over Denver, dropping literally grapefruit sized hail. But I want to go back to the May 3rd and 4th and 5th storms. There's a new satellite called GOES-16. It's a lightning mapper satellite. It just went up and went operational back on March 6th of 2017. What this does gives us amazing infrared imagery of strong storms and lightning strikes. This is over the Southern Plains of Mississippi Valley during that exact same atmospheric compression river that you saw. The images are amazing in themselves, but when you see this real time, I'm just gonna let this roll. That was indeed something you do not see every day. These are intensifying events that were predicted anyway with the onset of the grand solar minimum and these types of weather events that are going to wipe out our crops. And there's even more cloud density on the way as our galactic cosmic ray count increases another 19% on top of this over solar cycle 25. What you're seeing in these last two film rolls is going to be the commonplace in about three years from now. The heavier storms are going to come in about five years and make what you just saw look small in comparison. Thanks for watching. Hope you got something out of the video. You should be noticing your food prices rising probably in another two and a half weeks because the United States lost 40% of its wheat crop during this storm.